Hello, and once again, welcome back to the channel this weekend. Uh, I do apologise for putting out another one. I hope you don't mind too much. I do appreciate your time in watching these. Much, much appreciated. I cannot go into how much I appreciate everything you guys watch, everything you guys say, like, or whatever. Thank you. I'm just uh, all through it old guy in his 50s doing this to find out if I can do this and turns out I can and I can't <laughs> uh, I've had a couple of sales I've had a Lilliput farm sale uh, it's in the wrong box unfortunately this one says some lodge farthing lodge and inside is the Blaney castle I would get it out but it's a bit of a, a fun Next up, we've had, oh, we sold that for £9.25. I've paid two quid for it. And I've had it since the beginning of the year, about March time. And then next up for £6, uh, probably picked this up for a couple of quid of that. Not much profit on it. Um, I was just learning back then when I was picking up stuff, so I'm still learning today. I still don't know what game consoles actually sell really well. Until I get a hold of them, then I look it up and I think mm, maybe it's not. But that's one way of learning. I know not to pick up stuff like that again. Um, I could have done comps in the store, but back then I was a bit nervous, a bit shy to do stuff like that. Okay, next up, I'll show you a little photo. Hopefully I can add it in to here. And it looks a bit like this if I can. Okay, welcome back. I hope that works. <laughs> but I won't know until I try to fudge it together. Yes, fudge it. Um, I picked that up last December, 21st of December, I think. I bought that off of one of the charity shops on eBay. I paid 21 99 for it and the postage. Um, I knew I had getting a bargain back then been sitting around untested unlooked at not getting a, not getting anything from me at them until recently and then I picked it up had a look at the comps 65 pound I took a few photos um, listed it stuck a photo on Instagram where Tom's tat welcome Tom I put it brilliant guy we started on ET, ET, ebay roughly the same time and uh, he has one or two more subscribers than me <laughs> oh he's he's up there he is up there he picks up marvelous stuff i don't know how he does it half the time he's got contacts here and there and i wish i had one of them contacts to from yourself Love what he picks up. The condition of what he picks up is awesome as well. He knows his stuff. He he left his carpentry job to do it full time. I'm still working full time and doing this part time. So maybe that's what I need to do. And once I've got the confidence, the money behind us, I need to get that confidence to do the extra step. The more time I've got to concentrate on eBay and YouTube and everything else, the better everything will be. But that's something that's well off at the moment, unfortunately. I'm getting there, but slowly. Um, I said on Instagram that I listed it for £65. And he messaged me, I hope he doesn't mind me saying, he messaged me saying that looks in mint condition, apart from the box, of course. Um, he says I would go for 90 quid and he sent me a couple of comps and well yeah he's right he knows his stuff I would have lost out on about 30 quid 30 quid um, is a lot of money when you're doing this part time also I would have still been happy getting 60 
I had it on for £62 something. I still would have been happy to get that. I would still would have made a nice bit of profit for myself. But getting £90 quid for it will make a lot more profit. Which means I've got that little bit extra to go and get that little bit better quality stuff. Rather than going, going around the old places and picking up stuff that sells but not in the best quality if you know what i mean so every every helps so if you want to i'll put a link for him down below hit on his link and uh go and check out what he picks up you will be impressed if you haven't already watched him tom thank you very much once again okay okay just a quick one i'm just gonna box these up for tomorrow and then they get them posted. So, adios amigos. And uh, treat everybody how you want to be treated yourself, as usual. Thank you, gingerettes out there. My ginger fans, you mean a lot. Big up. And uh, catch you next time around. Bye for now.